type of energy I'm trying to see. Let's go, Nets. What's up, everybody? It's Coach Kev. Like, comment, subscribe. Nets vs. Blazers. They're saying this is Ben Simmons' best game of the season. I picked the Nets to go to the NBA championship. Is this the beginning of the wheels turning in the right direction? Let's check out the highlights. Let's see what Ben Simmons did, and let's talk about it. Let's see if the Nets are back on track. Come on, Ben. He's looking good. Good cut. Post. Tough Ben. Dazzling. Stupendous. Hey. I'm liking it. those lanes, those gaps, and making sure that you're capitalizing. Eubanks out of Troutdale, Oregon. Great outlet. As soon as you get the rebound, as soon as you catch the ball, or as soon as you get a turnover, steal, whatever you do in transition, look up on offense. Don't be so quick to dribble and put your head down like this. Catch it and look up for your players ahead, so even if they don't score when they catch the ball, that puts the pressure on the defense and it may open up something for a trailer. Great job, Ben Simmons. That's basketball one-on-one -on -one right there. Look up, look up! Go to work, Ben. Good pass! Mm. Upstairs, Durant and Simmons as he hammers it home. Up ahead, Harris. Harris hits the roller and it's Simmons. Gets it to go. Every possession matters, especially with the way that the Trailblazers can slow down the game. Good Back pass. Durant slams it down. Simons drives in on Watanabe. Poked out of there by Curry. Simmons maintains the dribble. No look. Watanabe pauses. Watanabe! Kaboom! Okay. So the biggest thing I noticed from this is um, Ben Simmons looks comfortable. So if you didn't know, Ben Simmons didn't play all last year. He had mental health issues and he had a lower back issue. Anybody who's ever had a lower back issue knows how much that is a detriment to everything you do. So I can imagine him trying to play professional basketball with that. But like I said, the biggest takeaway for me for, me for this is Ben Simmons looked comfortable. He looked comfortable, spry, just out there playing, no issues, not thinking about nothing else but balling. If we can continue to get that type of Ben Simmons, my NBA championship prediction will be there. Come on, baby. So let's listen to Kevin Durant post game. See what he had to say, man. Great film session. Um, right before we left sat yesterday, um, which showed us the just contrast between how we play when we're super locked in and how we play when we, you know, take a couple plays off like we did in Sacramento and it snowballed into losing about 30. So we seen both sides of us and we was able to come out and and uh, play our brand of basketball, which was gritty, defensive basketball, get up and down the floor. And I think we did. We hit all of those points tonight. Incredible. Incredible. I mean, just happy for him because, you know, he's been trying to get his form back, trying to figure his rhythm out. And tonight, I think he did a good job of just talking up, commanding the offense, commanding the team on the defensive side of the ball, just you know, he was he was incredible tonight. So we want to keep building on that, and um, you know, hopefully we uh, we get this next one. But he, he controlled the game and was able to get us back into it. I mean, I mean, that was I, I, to be honest, we had no doubts when he walked up there. You know, I, I felt like we all were confident just just the way the game was flowing and just how he was playing. Everybody felt his energy um, to start the game. So I, I felt super confident when he went up there. And so three for four. Crunch time like that, that was that was that was key for us. We needed those. Yeah, you know, I mean the heat hit them and you guys may have been top of the you know, 
I mean, if he shot him like he was confident and he ran back down court like he knew what was going in. So, like, um, you know, when he's playing aggressive like that, when he's down here, he's talking up to it. Like, he's, he, he, was, he did it all for us tonight. I'm excited for him because this type of game that we all needed to see. I think everybody else on the outside, basketball fans in general, was loving it. Uh, you know, couldn't wait to see this type of performance from him. So, like I said, we, we expect that from him every night. It just gives us all confidence, you know. Look how many wide open shots we got tonight, you know. Royce got a lot of wide open threes. Joe got started getting some threes. Yuda got some threes. Seth got some shots, you know. So I think Ben just get downhill, making plays, and then you combine that with Royce with 11 assists. Myself, who can create a little bit off the dribble, it just gives us, you know, more weapons out there on the floor. After, you talked about the film session after the Sacramento game, uh, 30 some odd. Situation is always good for practice, you know. Obviously, you know, uh, late in the season playoffs is the type of team you want to be. So, you know, as many games as you can get where you're working on your late game situations, you're working on your late game rotations, it's good for your team. Obviously, you want to win every game going away up 10 in the fourth quarter. But like, like you said, it's going to be games like this when we, we got to just figure it out. And then tonight we did. You know, Royce was incredible all night. I left the ball, left my hand, and it felt like it was going in, but the uh, voice was able to time it. And, you know, it was just one of those games we deserved to win, to be honest. Like, if you look at the stats from what they shot from the field, when we shot rebounding, assists, you know, all that stuff was in our favor, and I felt like we deserved to win this game. Yes, KD. Yes, KD. That's the KD I want, man. So he's, what, 30 points per game? Six rebounds, five assists a season. That's MVP type numbers to me. He was hyping up the team, hyping up the players, hyping up Ben. Woo! This is my NBA championship pick. Kyrie Irving is supposedly coming back on Sunday. Ah, the return of Kyrie Irving. This feels like it's about to get going. So everybody knows that Christmas Day is the unofficial start of the NBA season. So let's see where the Nets are on Christmas Day. But I'm excited for my NBA championship pick. Like KD said, and he said it multiple times, let's build off of this. No going backwards. Let's continue to build and build and build until we get to where we're supposed to be. Coach Kev, like, comment, subscribe. Trying to get to 2,000 subscribers. I can only do it with your help. Subscribe, and I'm out of here. Peace. And trying to get inside the head of Ben Simmons. He gets the roll on the first attempt. Portland will use a timeout. So they use it or lose a timeout for Chauncey Billups. Second attempt, Simmons. He nails it. And Simmons planks that one. To say. This better than me. I'm trying to. One out of two.